Today's medical-centric topic is Demystifying Intra-Abdominal Hypertension Causes, Consequences, and Care Welcome to our medical-centric channel. Today, we're discussing a critical yet often under-recognized condition in critical care medicine, intra-abdominal hypertension, IAH. This condition, characterized by elevated pressure within the abdomen, can have serious implications for various body systems. In this session, we will explore what IAH is, its causes, potential impacts on health, and the approaches to management and treatment. Understanding IAH is crucial for both healthcare professionals and patients in critical care settings. 1. What is intra-abdominal hypertension? Definition Intra-abdominal hypertension refers to a pathological increase in pressure within the abdominal cavity. Measurement The condition is typically diagnosed when the intra-abdominal pressure exceeds 12 mm Hg. 2. Causes of intra-abdominal hypertension Fluid accumulation Conditions leading to fluid accumulation in the abdomen, like ascites or pancreatitis, can cause IAH. Abdominal trauma Injuries causing bleeding or swelling within the abdomen. Post-surgery complications IAH can develop after abdominal surgeries due to tissue swelling or improper closure. Other medical conditions, such as bowel obstruction, severe burns, or sepsis. 3. Impact on health. Organ dysfunction. Elevated intra-abdominal pressure can impair the function of organs within and outside the abdominal cavity, including the lungs, kidneys, and heart. Abdominal Compartment Syndrome In severe cases, IAH can lead to Abdominal Compartment Syndrome, a life-threatening condition requiring emergency medical intervention. 4. Symptoms and Indicators Physical Signs Distension of the abdomen, difficulty in breathing, reduced urine output, and hypotension. Monitoring in critical care settings, continuous monitoring of abdominal pressure is often necessary for at-risk patients. 5. Diagnosis and Assessment Diagnostic Methods Diagnosis is typically based on direct measurement of intra-abdominal pressure through bladder pressure measurement. Clinical Assessment a thorough evaluation of the patient's medical history, physical examination, and imaging studies if necessary. 6. Treatment and Management Medical Management Initial management often involves optimizing body fluid balance, improving organ function, and relieving intra-abdominal pressure. Surgical Intervention In cases of abdominal compartment syndrome, Surgery may be necessary to relieve pressure and prevent organ damage. 7. Prevention and proactive care Risk factor identification Early identification of patients at risk of developing IAH Proactive monitoring Close monitoring in post-operative care and critical care settings for early signs of IAH Intra-abdominal hypertension is a serious condition that requires prompt recognition and management to prevent severe complications. If IAH is suspected or confirmed, multidisciplinary medical intervention is essential to improve patient outcomes and prevent long-term complications. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.